After watching this video, you'll probably never want to edit a photo manually again because I've spent days testing different AI tools, and I finally found one that truly changes the game. With this tool, you can edit photos just by typing or even speaking. You can do almost anything, turn a photo into a 3D Pixar-style image, remove objects in seconds, and so much more. All you have to do is talk to the AI, and it takes care of the edits for you. And the best part? You don't need any editing skills at all. So, let's get started. So, in today's video, we're going to use a tool called Photo. More specifically, we'll be testing out their brand new feature called the Photo AI Agent. Think of it as your personal photo editing assistant. It's way more advanced than just editing or adding filters. And here's the really cool part. You can actually talk to it. Just say what you want, and the app makes the edits for you. If you'd like to try it out yourself, I've left a link in the description below. First, head over to Photo.com and sign in with your account. Now, once you log in, you'll land on the homepage. At the very top, you'll see all of Photo's AI tools, both for photos and videos. But for for this tutorial, we're going to focus on the AI agent, which you can find on the left-hand menu all the way at the bottom. Go ahead and click on that, and you'll see the prompt window open up. Next, let's check out the tutorial section by clicking right here. This brings up a quick guide with lots of example prompts you can use. These are really handy, especially if you're just starting out. Now, inside this editor, you'll see two main options. One box to type in the edits you want the AI to make, and another option to upload the photo you want to work on. Okay, let's try something fun together. I'm going to upload a photo right here. Once it's in, I want to change the hair color of the person in the image. So, in the text box, I'll simply type, change the hair color to dark. After that, I just click create. At this point, Photo will take a short moment, usually less than a minute, to process the request. And once it's done, it gives you back the edited photo. Let's take a look at the result. As you can see, it looks fantastic. The photo is still clearly the same person, but now the hair color is completely different. What's even more impressive is how naturally the new hair blends with the face and head. Photo's AI agent can do so much more than basic edits. You'll be surprised at how powerful it really is. Let's try something different, removing a subject from a photo. So, I'm going to upload a new picture. Here it is. In this photo, there's a bicycle, and I want to remove it completely. All I have to do is type, remove the bicycle from the background, and then click create. Within just a few seconds, the edit is finished. Let's take a look. As you can see, the bicycle is completely gone, and the rest of the image looks untouched. That's really impressive. It did an excellent job keeping everything else the same. Now, let's push it a little further. I'm uploading the same image, and this this time, I'm going to type, turn the two women into 3D Pixar style while keeping the real background the same. And here's the result I got. Honestly, this is amazing. Fodor's AI agent transformed the two women into 3D Pixar style characters, but the background stayed realistic. That combination looks super creative. And to be honest, it's something you'd normally expect from advanced professional software. Now here's something even cooler. Fodor actually has a voice input option. This means you don't even have to type your prompts anymore. Let me show you how it works. I'll go back to the AI agent section and and add the edited image clicking here. Now, normally, you would type your request in the text box, but this time, I'm going to click on the small icon here. When I tap that, it starts recording my voice, and I can literally just say what I want the AI to do. For example, I'll speak my first prompt, remove the background of this image. Then, I just hit create. As you can see, the app instantly converts my speech into text, and in just a moment, the background is completely gone. Pretty smooth, right? Let's try another one. This time, I want to remove the watermark on this image. So again, I use the voice command and say, remove the watermark. And within seconds, Fodor's AI agent clears the watermark perfectly while keeping the rest of the photo the same. Really cool. So now you know, you can completely transform your images using just one sentence, either by typing or speaking, and still get results that look good. Now, another really valuable feature that Fodor offers is its built-in editing tools. To access them, just click on the image you got back from the AI. Once you're inside, hit the edit button at the bottom. This opens up a full editing suite where you can do so much more. For for example, you can upscale an image, magically erase objects, retouch skin, fix blurry faces, and use plenty of other tools listed on the left-hand side. Let me give you a quick example. If you want to upscale an image, just click on AI Upscale, adjust the settings, and then hit Generate. In just a few seconds, your photo comes back looking sharper and higher quality. You can even turn images into videos with just one click. By the way, I've already made separate videos about Fodor's AI Image Generator and AI Video Tools, so definitely check those out if you want a deeper dive. And the best part is Fodor Fast, simple to use and free to try. Fodor has a pretty generous free plan that gives you basic editing tools, design templates, and even some free credits to test out their AI features. But if you really want to unlock the full power of what I just showed you, their pro plan is only about $3.33 per month. With that, you get advanced AI tools, 100 monthly credits for AI generation, HD downloads without watermarks, and access to over 100,000 premium templates. 
sense. So, if you're ready to start editing your photos just by typing or even speaking your commands, head over to Fodor and try it for free using the link in my description. That's it for today's tutorial. If you need any help, feel free to join our Discord or Telegram group. It's the perfect place to ask questions, share your creations, and connect with other creators who can help you make even better videos. Plus, you'll find all the AI tools and the exact prompts we used in this tutorial, so you can try them out yourself. If this tutorial helped you, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you never miss a new video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.